your word throughout the church and the world, O oh God, and for educational institutions that prepare leaders, that you will lift up prophets in our congregations. Let us pray. Yeah, for the works of God revealed in and through creation, for an end to pollution and unjust use of natural resources, and for good weather this season, let us pray. Yeah, for peace and justice throughout the world, for political leaders at all levels, and for those who provide public services, that you will grant them wisdom and hope as they carry out their tasks. Let us pray. Have mercy, O God. For the homeless, the unemployed, the underemployed, and their advocates, for the sick, the suffering, and their caregivers, for those mourning the loss of loved ones, and for the weak in body, mind, and spirit. Pray especially for Carl, the Homeless family, Marge, Bonnie, Don and his family, Stefanak family, for Ellie and the DeAngelis family. Let your compassion be felt by all in need. Let us pray. For those in our congregation celebrating special events, for the birth of Brooke and Harper, for those celebrating birthdays, for those missing from our worship today, and for friends and family, both near and far, let us pray. For those in our military, that they feel your presence and your calming peace in and among them, that they know you in their minds and in their hearts, let us pray. In thanksgiving for the faithful departed who witnessed your love in their lives and in this world, that through them their own faith will grow stronger, let us pray. God. Merciful God, you hear our prayers even before we speak them. Receive them for the sake of the one through whom you have revealed your goodness, Jesus Christ, our Savior and Lord. Amen. Amen. Blessed be the Holy Trinity, one God who stretches out the heavens, who sends light to the nations, who gives breath to us all. Amen. Let us confess our sin in the presence of God and in one another. <coughs> Loving God, we confess yes, we have turned from your way to follow our own ways. Forgive us the times we have spoken or acted too quickly. We have not spoken or acted at all. We have heard those closest to us. We have heard those we have yet to know. We have thought more about ourselves than others. We have thought less of ourselves than we ought. Turn us around and give us a fresh start so that we can live again as your children. Even when we have done wrong, God makes us right. Even when we have messed up, God puts us together again. God's love never runs out. God never tires of calling us beloved children. Hear God say to you now, your sins are forgiven for the sake of Jesus Christ, our Savior. Amen. Peace of Christ be with you all. And also with you.